That is insane. What's going on YouTube? So in today's video, we're gonna be upgrading the headlights. As you can see, I got these headlights here. They're cheap, I got them on Amazon. I think they're only like 30 bucks or something like that. But they're LED headlights, very bright. Hopefully, we're gonna find out. Um, basically, if you don't know how to change a light bulb, it's super simple. You just unplug the harness and unclip it. And then these just plug right in. No modifications needed other than I made some breather holes for the little fan that's on the LED bulb. You'll see that later on in the video. Uh, right now what I'm doing is I'm unplugging the wire harness. So get the wire harness unplugged, taking the light bulb out. Now you can see the difference in the light bulb. You know, the LED one on the left, the factory one on the right. And uh, at the end of the video I'll uh, do a night shot to see how bright the lights are. But as you can see, it just goes right back into the same slot that the original bulb came out of. Just push it in and twist it till it locks into place. And then plug the harness in. Now it can you can plug the harness in backwards and the light won't turn on. So if your lights don't turn on, just flip the harness around and you plug it back in and then the light should turn on. If it doesn't turn on at that point, then there's probably something wrong with it. Um, what we'll do now is we'll turn the light bulb on, turn the headlights on, make sure the light bulb works. And it works. All right. So basically, that's all you need to do. You just repeat that same process for the other side. Now, the Freightliner has this plastic rubber sh shield to prevent, you know, rocks or road grime or anything from hitting the light bulb on the back side. But the LED light bulbs have a little cooling fan to keep them cool because they get warmer than a regular light bulb. So what I did was I just drilled some holes in that little rubber cover so that the fan can breathe. So we'll cut to the next scene. I'll get the drill. So here I got the drill. I put a drill bit on it. And I'm just drilling out you know, small holes in the rubber cover so that it can ventilate. And unfortunately you can't see what's going on in the video. Um, I have a, the chest mount, so the chest mount's not very good. Uh, the next video I make, I'll, I'll use the head mount, so that way you can you guys get a bit of better view of what I'm doing. But literally, it's just a rubber cover thing. I'm just putting some holes in it so that it can vent. And then you just put the cover back on, and that's that. Um, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to clean up the wiring harness. Um, zip tie it so there's not a bunch of wires and stuff hanging down. I'm just putting the cover back in place right now. So, I okay, grabbed a, a zip tie, cable tie, whatever you want to call it. You know, I call them zip ties. It's super windy, so that's why I had to record the audio on this separately. Because the original audio was ruined. It was so windy. All you heard was wind noise. But you just bundle it up into a little ball. You know, nice and neat. And then I just zip tied it together. So that it cleans it up. And it prevents it from dangling down. And that's that. And you just cut the leftover zip tie. And you're done. And you just repeat the process to the other side. And that was it. Alright it's night time now. Let's go ahead and see what we're working with. It should be way brighter than the factory headlight bulbs and yep way brighter definitely gonna have better vision at night safer for me to drive at night as well well appreciate y'all watching the video and please subscribe if you haven't for more content thanks for